did see him one time. Hello friends and welcome to the Kitty Hawk Kite Festival. Kenny Burns and I, KB Kites. We're hauling all of our kite gear out to Fort Walton Beach for this festival. This is a beautiful day on the kite field. Welcome friends. What appears we have turned in one day of clouds and no wind for a day of no clouds and no wind. Very little wind. Got enough to keep the uh, turtle kite shade up in the air, flowing nicely. There's some really cool versions of this out here. If you haven't seen these, they're really cool to like hang out under. It's a very nice sunshade on a day like today. Some people are putting up their things there. Might migrate over to one of those myself. They're, they're setting up, I think, four or five of those today, along with some light wind ground display things. You're setting up the cellular kites that I put up yesterday and maybe a couple banners. It's gonna be a good day, even with no wind. Mm. Good beer. A lot of people on the beach right now, dude. Yeah. It's filling up. Well, I finally got these two kites put up. They went together a little, a little more difficult today than yesterday. Had some help from Kenny here for about uh, I don't know how long did we work on it? Half an hour? Yeah, I'd say so. Our blood, sweat, and tears. <laughs> yep, blood, sweat, and tears. Still no wind. That's what we're crying about. Yeah. It's a nice shade you got there, Kenny. Thank you. Poor crab. Can't do what he really wants to do. Blow around in the wind. Just no wind. It's cool though. Having a good time. Chilling. What are these? These are bouncing buddies. Little oh, bouncing buddies. Yes. This Which is, buddy is this one? This is a super cool spinner buddy do. Cool. Whirly do. This looks beautiful when it's on a line. Cool. Yeah, this one. Premium. Found some buddy crab. Which is actually right there and learning how to fly. He's learning. He's yep. in the process. All right, I want to get the point. A seal, maybe? I don't know if that's a seal or not. It, it looks like a it ghost. It has the whiskers. Maybe it's a catfish? Ooh, I don't think so. Look at his. Or a manatee. Maybe. A, is it a baby manatee with whiskers? I don't know. An interesting day today on the yeah, beach. Look at the look at the, the wind is changing very much. It's strange. It's not very strong, but we just watched a kite. This, there it is. See the kite up there? We just watched it do a total 360 real slow and switch directions. Wind is weird. And it's really cool to get a kite up there just even a little bit. You can feel different levels of what the wind is doing. It's a really interesting way to feel the unseen around you. You can pretty much only do that with a kite. <laughs> we're like, we got a thermal. Yeah. A thermal here, man. I saw it switch directions a little bit ago. Oh my gosh, look at that. It's like a balloon almost. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Now it If it starts coming off the water, we'll be in great shape. Going up. Going up. But then before you're um, to moor it, so you get some slack like this. Pull it out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Take here. You do a um, loop like this. And you pull it through like this, okay? And you move your from like this and then just catch your catch it like that mm -hmm. and you can do a few things you can clip it into a carabiner or you can do a lark's head a big lark's head on a you know bite like this mm -hmm. and then at the end of the day take this out you split it you got four here 
and you got two here. You grab the two, pop it, and then it's fine. It's pretty easy on line. It, it's better than just taking your line and doing that into a carabiner. That's kind of hard on the line. Yeah. So yeah, I don't know how are we doing? Are we Got some wind now. Well, the wind has picked up quite nicely today. It's coming right off the water, which is glorious. And I'm gonna pull out this octopus. A lot of fabric in this bag. I really like flying these bigger kites. Of course, I love the quad line world and the dual line world and single line world too. But, well, I guess this is single line. The small single line is what I meant. I think you know what I meant. Anyway, time to stop talking and get to unpacking. With the better weather and the higher winds, the kites started going up in the air, which attracted many more spectators to this part of the beach. There was a kite shop in one of the buildings nearby selling kites, the Kitty Hawk Kite Shop, and the Kitty Hawk Kites booth selling kites right out on the beach, along with some kite making kits for kids. There's a lot going on. I didn't feel like I had a lot of time to wander around and visit some of the other kite flyers, because I felt responsible for setting up these bigger kites and making sure they were safe through the whole time. I love this. Check this out. It's already gathered a crowd of people. A little closer to the building though, might bring it in. Turning out to be a nice day. As the day went on, I was able to break away and take a look at some of the other kites that friends had set up. I especially like these Revolution kites on the stakes. What a cool display. I've got this Flowform 252. It's made by Steve Sutton. It's kind of an old kite, but I've never flown this one. I've flown another one before. It was one of my favorite kites I've ever flown. Let's put it on the sky. Got the flow form up. It's looking good. You can tell it's spring break time. There's tons of people on the beach loving these kites. Had a lot of conversations with people that were complimenting how cool they were. Such a big crowd. Here's a fun fact, friends. This Randy Tom Masterpiece Kite by Revolution was the very first the number one masterpiece kite ever made. Right here. Kitty and I are adding a windsock to the line. This will be a nice one. I'm just holding on to the line here with the pulley. I prefer to use a pulley like this instead of just a carabiner. That's how we get the lines down. And add the sock. Cool windsock. Just hanging out. Busy, busy day on the beach. Cool backdrop. That's <sighs> this is great. The weather's so perfect right now. The wind is perfect. Lots of kites are flying. Just relaxing under the KB Kites, Kite Shade at the moment. Enjoying the day. Won't be long, we'll have to start taking down the kites. 
but there's so many people out here on the beach, thousands of people. It's like spring break or something, but it's not spring break. It's just lots of people enjoying the kites. Cool, cool day. All right, Kenny, it's about time to wrap it up for the day. What's the plan? Put some tunes on and uh, we'll go down to the short takedown to start dropping them slowly, one at a time. Sounds good, dude. All right, bro. try a different way of pulling the, the kite down on this occasion because right now where the octopus sits it's right above a hotel or very near it so we drop it down we're going to be all on top of people and stuff so we're going to try something we have this pulley and carabiners let's see what happens Last kite up, right here. This has been a really good day on the beach, friends. I appreciate you joining me here and all of the kiting friends of the Kitty Hawk Kite Festival. It's been really fun. I appreciate it, friends. I'll see you in the next video and happy flying.